So a mile race for the older horses this time. We've gone to Newmarket for this one. And the top one is Everton Brook for Paul Fisk. Umbrian Fontenay for David Robertson. Orange Sunset, Derek Hinton. House that Frank built, Joshua Sullivan. Wartime lies, Leon Van Rensburg. Craft Show, Obi-Wan. Executive Kim Varbo. Andy Morgan, Hidden Wagon. See Beckwith, Marmalejo. Darren Thompson, Dynamite, Paul O'Neill. Siping Kenneth for... Vinnie Gerard, Al Baggy for Alex Cherry, Never Look Back Hems, Flojo Martin Lidham and Woodcutting Gwen, Paul Rhodes. Big field then, that's probably why we've moved to Newmarket. And one's refused to come out of the stalls. Everton Brook has refused to race. So that one is still in the stalls then. I'm going to take any part. And Craft Show is the early leader. So a little bit of drama on trials day as Craft Show is in the lead. Woodcutting Gwen is second as we change angles. Then Dynamite is after that one. Executive Kim Varbo after that one. Al Baggy and Flojo are the back two, but it's Craft Show showing the way in the lead then to Woodcutting Gwen in second. Then Dynamite and Executive Kim Varbo. Marmalee Joe and House that Frank built are next. And on this near side, you can see Flojo is just about the back marker, but Craft Show's in the lead from Woodcutting Gwen in second. Then Siping Kalef is after that one. House that Frank built. Umbrian Fontenay is also trying to make a forward move. Dynamite is also going pretty well, but it's Craft Show in the lead still by about a length from Siping Piping Kelev in second. Up this near side, Umbrian Fontenay is now coming through with a big run, and behind that one is Never Look Back. They're pretty clo closely grouped, really, and it's Craft Show in the lead as they pass the three furlong pole. But now, Umbrian Fontenay is going to take it up, I think, right over on the far side. Dynamite is bursting through to get in front. Hidden Wagon is coming through. It's over the far side, and they've got the lead then now, and they're a good couple of lengths clear past the two furlong pole. The two on the rail are leading the way. Dynamite and Hidden Wagon never look back on this near side. He's still trying to get it. Craft Show's still there as well. But it's Dynamite past the furlong pole. Dynamite by about three quarters of a length from Hidden Wagon. Then never look back. Woodcutting Gwen Executive Kim Varbo. But it's Dynamite who's clear now by a length. It's a race up towards line. And Dynamite's going to take it. Dynamite wins it from Hidden Wagon. Second in Woodcutting Gwen. And never look back. And Executive Kim Varbo. And then Marmalejo on wartime lies. All oh, Baggy was the last one to finish. And it was the horses on the far side on the rail that had it and let's get a look at the connections don't recognize those colors and the win for Donna for Paul O'Neill Paul O'Neill was a new player or a returner from many years ago but well done Hidden Wagon for C Beckwith second another name that's not been around for the last few seasons Woodcutting Gwen third for Paul Rhodes and Never look back for Hems fourth and executive Kim Varbo for Andy Morgan fifth. So good to see some new names or maybe some returning names from before I was around. But that was a pretty good win. I'm sure Paul O'Neill will be delighted.